Yo, what's up, guys? Rage Cage 20 here with World of Warcraft, and we got okay. We I got some explaining to do. All right, follow me here, okay? Okay, don't, don't let me lose you. All right, are you are you in here with me? Are you tucked in to this with me? Because if not, tuck yourself in. Whatever the fuck that means to you, I don't know. And get ready. So, as you may have noticed, I've kind of got like two levels. <laughs> okay, follow me here. Um, <clears throat> from the last time you saw me, well, let me explain why. I have done nothing but one quest. And here's why I didn't show you the quest. So, you remember that pally quest that was down here, like right around here, to get that weapon that may or may not be the same weapon that's on my back? Well, I decided to do that, and as I mentioned, I wasn't going to show Dead Mines because I already done Dead Mines. I literally just I tried to find a group for Dead Mines, and it was impossible. I literally healed Dead Mines. And are you ready to? I'm going to flip over to my healing bar, which is the second one here of my bars, and you, you're going to be surprised at how intense this healing bar is. I can't remember if it's Control or Alt or Shift. I think it's Control. Nope, Shift, Shift. Look at that. That right there. That's comp that's complex right there. Look at my healing style. One and two, occasionally three to stun. That's about it. So I went over, I bought some healing gear, which I have on me just in case if I want to go, you know, healing at any point. Um I also got a bigger silver bag because uh, I wish I could go tanking. I would have just bought a sword and shield and just tried tanking. Um but uh, it occurred to me, Jesus, that's provocative clothing right there on that dwarf. It was weirdly shaped. Um, but then I realized I haven't bought like a single tank spell, and I would have to go spend a bunch of money on tank spells, and like that's not really worth it to me. Like Devotion Aura is still only rank two, and I think it can be like rank three or four by now. So. Yeah, I don't have the threat generating spell. I don't have like any tank abilities. Uh, so I was thinking of going holy, but then when I looked at it, looked at the like first off, it cost a gold, and then it costs more every time you. So it'd be like two to three gold. Just probably switch there and back. And I looked at it. I was like, I only have like twelve points to spend. I can get like two, like maybe eight to twelve percent increase in my healing. And that's it. <laughs> so going full holy is really not gonna do anything for me. So I'm just gonna heal as retribution with intellect gear. And I did, and it worked just fine. <laughs> I, I got through two dungeons doing that, and I'll explain that later. So I went through Dead Mines, and then I went over to do the second part to get the uh, the ore shipment that hadn't come in. I flew over to Loch Modan. I talked to the guy, I literally, all I had to do was swim across the lake, walk into this stronghold where a bunch of people were already grouping and killing the things, so I just walked in the middle, grabbed the the crate, and then we'll walk back. So that, you missed me fly, walk to a place, and walk back. Didn't think you needed to see that, or wanted to see that, just me walking. Uh, apologies if you did. Uh, let me know for the future if you want to see me walk around everywhere, that's fine. Uh, the next part, I had to do Shadowfang Keep. So I traveled my happy ass all the fucking way uh, up. I ran through the wetlands, ran through a Rothy, got Refugee Point, ran through Hillsbrad. Uh, I don't need to find out that there's a flight plan here that I didn't grab. Ran all the way up to the Silver Pine over to Shadowfang Keep just to sit there for probably 30 minutes. Uh, I joined the channel. Uh, oh, it's down here. I joined the channel looking for group. You can't see it right now. I actually literally had to type in join look. <laughs> if I can spell looking for group. So I could join that. And as you'll see here in a moment. A uh, bunch of people constantly commenting on for different groups. Luckily, my friends told me about this because I didn't know this was a thing, <laughs> and I, I would have been sitting there for probably three hours before getting a group. Uh, so using that, I was finally able to uh, to find a group for Shadowfin Keep, which was super hard. 
to run through with because like two of the people were constant like the hunter and the tank were constantly AFKing, so we were just like slow pulling shit while I healed like either the hunter pet or the warlock pet or <laughs> you know. Um and then yeah, so it was slow, long, and arduous. I was like, I don't think you guys are going to want to watch this or even bother seeing this, so I'm just going to do this all off camera. I don't care. Because uh, you'll see Shadow Frank Keep eventually. Don't worry about it. Uh, whenever I play the undead, which I have no idea when that's going to be, but whenever I play the undead, uh, <coughs> you guys will definitely see Shadow Frank Keep run. Don't worry about it. Uh, that's going to happen. Uh, so I was just like, you know, not gonna bother with it. So I went through Shadowfin Keep, got, uh, got the item I needed, the hammer from there, which was just like after the f first boss, which really isn't a boss. Um, it's just right fucking there. It's really easy to get, but I was like, no reason to wait for like a half an hour, get these people all the way here to be like, okay, hey, healers out, peace. <laughs> that's all I wanted, all I needed. So I was like, I'll run the rest with them. And if anyone leaves, I don't care, I'll leave too. Um, and then after that, I had one more piece to get. So I had to run my happy ass all the way over here to Dark Shore. Find the dude here in Aberdyne or Aberdeen. Uh, <coughs> and talk to him. And then he's like, hey, run your happy ass all the way down to Ashenvale. Which if I can click on it all the way up here to Black Fathom Deeps, which was the name I was trying to think of earlier that I couldn't think of, and run Black Fathom Deeps so you, so one of these people can drop uh, a corrupted core gem and you can bring it back to me and I'll purify it. Well, I did not run Black Fathom Deeps. Otherwise, I would be 24, probably almost 25. <laughs> um, I instead uh, just ran in there as like, maybe I can kill an elite get lucky just farm these elites uh, outside uh, and get one I killed one elite dropped it instantly didn't have to run the dungeon <laughs> I only had to kill one thing and then ran all the way actually I fucked up because I was just like oh I have the gym I'll go back to Ironforge and then as I flew into Ironforge I realized uh, came back for came back to Mytho Harbor flew to Ironforge I realized Fuck! I have to talk to him and purify it. So I went back to Mithra Harbor, went all the way back over to Dark Shore, ran it to him just so I could portal back and run all the way back to Ironforge and finally get the fucking hammer, which is the one I talked to you about. 65 to 99 damage, 25 DPS, 3.2 attack, so he's 6 to like 7 stamina, 12 spirit. <laughs> finally! Got this thing. <laughs> Uh, so that's the reason I got two levels of experience. It literally took all fucking day Saturday. Um, <laughs> it literally took me at least around six hours probably to pull off. And I was just like, I don't really think you guys need to see that. You know, I don't think you want to see that. I don't think you need to see that. But the good news is from getting that level, almost two levels, all my quests are yellow. We can do fucking all of them, except for Suckcase. But we can do fucking all of them. So that's really, that's awesome. Um, so we're going to try to finish up uh, Red Ridge here. Get to 24, hopefully close to 25. And then jump on over to Duskwood and start doing shit over in Duskwood. So, sorry you guys missed a level. I just put another 2% into my strength. I uh, got some spells. Uh, I think I got Seal of Crusader rank 3. Uh, Blessing of Might rank 3, so now I get 66 increased attack power, which is pretty nice. I got uh, Holy Light rank 4. Um, uh, you saw me get Sense of Dead, I believe. I think that's it. Um, yep, because I, I think I could have got some other protection stuff, but I still have it. Just because, I don't, I don't think I'm going to. Um, but I really did enjoy healing as a paladin. Now I'm actually going to start moving towards quests. It was a long explanation, but you know, I got like two levels of experience, so kind of needed to give you a long explanation for that. Uh, but yeah, um, oh, that's I don't remember. Uh, oh yeah, I really liked healing as a paladin. It bring me back to the, uh, 
Burning Crusade, uh, Wrath of the Lich King days, to where you only had like two or three spells. <laughs> it's just paladins are very basic. You don't you don't need a lot of spells on them. Uh, by the way, first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna go after Yaller. I killed him on my rogue by myself pretty easily. I should be able to take him decently with my with my paladin. Uh, it's just he's usually in a group of three, so that's kind of gonna be, it's gonna be a problem for my paladin. I'm not gonna lie to you. It's definitely gonna be a problem for my paladin, but. We'll see if maybe we can pick one off here or there or whatnot, but we're going to fight our way over there. In the meantime, uh, see what happens. <laughs> my, well, I'm 23, right? Yeah, I'm 23. My rogue is also level 23. Uh, so she's about a quarter of experience down from this, so. But I did a lot of work on fucking uh, Saturday, man. Look at that damage. Uh, but yeah, I really, I really kind of enjoy the simplicity of a paladin. Uh, I kind of wish Rep Paladin was a little bit more, you know, <sighs> uh, engaging. Maybe not as simplistic, but I really do enjoy the simplicity of paladin healing. It's pretty much just spam heals on people. Just single target healing. No one out single target heals me. <laughs> I'm fucking boss at that shit, you know. Uh, that's a lot of fun. I do enjoy that. And as you can see, this damage is out of control. Like, look at that damage right there. Absolutely awesome. I know they're green to me, but still, that damage is pretty fucking badass now. And I learned something while I was looking for a group to do these quests. I was on Discord with my with my guildmates, my, my close personal friends. Um since like high school uh, that you guys have heard before uh, on many different streams and whatnot. Um, if you've watched my streams, you've heard before, I guess I should clarify. And crypto. Um, yeah, I, I don't think we're going to have a problem <laughs> fighting Yeller. Uh, his guards will be yellow. Some of them at least will be. The alphas are. He might have a green in there if we're lucky, which would be very helpful. I can just try to take out the green. The best of my ability. <laughs> I really do wish I was the level to have some points in spiritual focus, but it is what it is. You know, it, it just. That's all I can say. Uh, it just, it is what it is. <laughs> uh, I'm really glad someone gave me this intellect buff. That uh, 7 in there is actually going to be very helpful. I meant to stop that. Like, oh, yeah! Yeah! Anywho. Oh, he just ran up and bashed me. Uh, but it is what it is. We can't do anything until we get two more ranks into Divine Strength. So we just got to accept what it is. And we might even level up on our, our way over to Yow Yowster. Uh, so that'd be pretty good. Uh, give me maybe two puffs of the flash. Nice. Um, yeah. But uh, as I was talking to them, because I, I, I was baffled, because I put, I took off all my strength gear, put on all my intellect gear, even had an intellect hammer, two-handed hammer. I couldn't find a one-handed intellect mace. I could find a bunch of two-handed intellect maces. I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> so I just went two-handed healing mace. Uh, since he's green, I might be able to pull the alpha if I just inch up to him alone. Maybe. It's a possibility. Alright, if we line our side and we can take this alpha. Uh, okay. That didn't work. So let's pull it back. Did you get the ass over there? What the shit? <laughs> oh, I forgot about that. I forgot that's a thing that happens. I killed one. Let's get out of here. Plus protection. It's okay, it's a five minute. Cool down my way about the shit. Oh, that's only protection. Uh, okay. I panicked to use that because if the fucker I forgot that they rush up there I should have known that because I saw that so many times on my rogue but it is what it is we just need to go clear the way so that was an unfortunate cooldown I was really looking forward to that potion being able to be used but we didn't use lay on hands and we'll still have a divine protection god that really is only physical attacks isn't it wow all right, so it should only be the no. We killed the alpha, which is what we needed to do. But yeah, uh, I was doing the same amount of damage on full intellect gear that I was doing with my uh, 
uh, with my full strength gear and strength weapon. I was doing the same amount of damage. And I was, I would say, rightfully perplexed, <laughs> I think was a good term for it. I was insanely perplexed. That is green with his troop. That is very good for us. Let's come up here and kill this mystic. Before We need to start killing shit before stuff starts responding. Um, that's going to be good for me. Though, luckily, things do take a while to respond, so we should be fine with the rate that we're killing things. Anywho. <coughs> uh, so, uh, so, I was talking to uh, What the Heals. You guys have seen him before many times. He's on my friend list. He's not on right now, though. He's right there. What the Heal. Because uh, he's the person in the guild that's already level fucking 60, and it's crazy. Come here, Alpha. Um, he's already level 60 and like already has a level 30, while the rest of my friends are like level 30 or like 40, my early 40s. He's, he, he's got a lot of free time. And he even has a job and a wife, and apparently he's got a lot of free time. I don't fucking, I don't know. Uh, whatever. Yeah. He, do, do you, may not, not me, do you. I think I dropped the wrong seal on the dude. Oh well, we can stun him if he tries to run him to the game. Oh, no. oh, and we got that level, so we can get 2% more strength, which I always like to see how much that is. One, another one. Hey, we got like 4 strength from that, so that's pretty good, you know what I mean? Alright, so we need this buff on us. Okay. So we come in, we kill the mystic. Ooh, the alpha is now green to us too, which is nice. It's going to help a lot. Um, we come in, we kill the mystic. Try to st stun Hagar. Not Hagar, Yaller. <laughs> Having flashbacks. Um, we got to kill the mystic first because he'll heal. And he's the easiest to kill. He'll, he'll die really fast. So quickly become a 2v2. Probably have to heal after that. Focus down the alpha, if at all possible. And then it would just be me you mean Yowler probably be at half to quarter mana at that point would be my guess due to the healing. But it should be possible with things like Lay on Hands. So, that's our game plan. Our stun is back up, so let's do this. Wanna, we don't want to take too much damage before we get on this Mystic. That's our, our goal. There we go. Finish the Mystic, get a heal off. Hopefully. Our judgment's back up, drop it on him. As I said, at this point we're probably at half mana. Come on, we gotta get some lucky hits on this alpha dude. Hit. Oh, I thought we were gonna have to drop it on him. We need to get a heal out. Yeah, this is this is going very well. Maybe if we can get a flash after that. Yep. Perfect. Drop judgment on him, switch over. Yep, Yeller's dead. He did, he doesn't stand a chance against me now. I have too much mana. And he has no more backup, so we're fine. And I can drop my judgment on him when he starts running. Didn't even need to. Easy kill. We we're, were starting things are starting to look up for us, guys. Things are starting to look up for us. As a paladin. We're getting this shit down. We're getting actual gear that can make actually protect us. Things are looking good for us right now. And I love it. Fan fucking tastic. That is that is great. That is great news. <laughs> but yeah, I was talking to him when I was like, what the fuck? Like, why do you even have stats if they don't do anything? You know? <laughs> like, strength apparently doesn't increase my damage, so why the fuck do I even have strength? And uh he laid it down on uh, for me. He's like, you know, pretty much, especially early game, like it's it's pretty much your weapon. Your weapon decides the damage you have, the damage you do. Uh, of course, it's attack speed. Strength does increase your damage, but not by vast amounts, especially not early in the game. Not to like level 60 and shit. <coughs> and I was like, okay, I get it. I get that. Um, so, and pretty much the damage was doing the same DPS. So that was like, hey, that definitely reinforces in me that I need to get this weapon because the DPS, the damage doubles, the DPS doubles, and you know, obviously, having intellect doesn't fucking matter. <laughs> it's just gonna give me more mana and possibly a little bit more damage on my um, uh, consecration. So, 
you know, not a bad idea. Might as well pop that. A little help here. Um.